Thank you very much. Member statements. The member for Sudbury. Thank you, Speaker. It's a pleasure to rise in the House to brag about the riding of Sudbury. Today, I'm going to brag about Laurentian University, my alma mater, because this spring, Laurentian became the first university in Ontario, the first, to reinstate full tuition exemption for students who are in extended care of the Children's Aid Society of Ontario. So many of the people would know that as foster care. And as you know, Speaker, the Conservative government deep cuts to OSAP last year. They ripped away support for students. And without those grants and the financial assistance, already difficult prospect of pursuing post-secondary education becomes even more difficult for former youth and care Ontarians. However, Speaker, last year I met with Jane Kovrakova at Queen's Park, and Jane was someone who was a former youth and care Ontarian. She was someone who graduated from Lynch University, someone who is currently pursuing her doctorate, but somebody who remembered her education struggles as a former youth in care. And Jane was someone who believed it didn't have to be that way. So, Speaker, Jane founded the Children Welfare Political Action Committee, and she spoke about the untapped potential and how important education is to financial success and how their success becomes Ontario's success. And this resonated with me, so I invited Jane to Sudbury and I facilitated meetings between Jane and Laurentian University. And I am thrilled to share, Speaker, that this summer, my university, Laurentian University, announced it'll be waiving tuition to 10 former youth and care Ontarians. No age restrictions, no course restrictions, and I am so proud to have been part of this process. I want to thank Jane for knowing it didn't have to be that way and finding the courage to change it. And I'm especially proud of Sudbury's Laurentian University for leading the way for being Ontario's first university to reinstate full tuition exemptions for students from the extended care of Children's Aid Society of Ontario. Thank you, Speaker. Good job, Jim. Thank you very much.